24-year-old man by the name of Noah Smith in South Carolina uh, was caught with a computer mouse up his rectum. He was burglarizing a home, and the owners of the home actually called the authorities, and when they responded, uh, they found uh, Noah Smith at the doorway of the house. Uh, he was very, very difficult to uh, basically arrest. He was resisting arrest. Uh, in fact, he started kicking police. They tased him. It didn't work. He ran into the bedroom. Uh, they pepper sprayed him. It didn't work. He, he continued to kick and scream. Finally, they did get a handle on the guy uh, and uh, they had to hog tie him. Uh, and uh, they are thinking that he was on mushrooms, but Jenk thinks he's probably on bath salts. Well, anytime this kind of stuff happens, yeah. uh, I immediately assume bath salts. Okay, so the, think about how trippy this is. In your home, there's a naked dude with a mouse stuck up his ass. Okay. How do you put a mouse up your ass? I don't know, dude. I don't know. But the thing is, like, how much would that scare you out of your living mind? I don't know what I would do. I, I don't even think I would wait and call the cops. I think I would find a way to get the hell out of the house. Oh yeah, no question. Get out of the house first, and then call the cops. Yeah. And when the cops come. He's so, you know, he in took a trance. A, he tried to take a bite out of one of the cops, See, by the way. See, come on, bath salts. <laughs> I rest my case. Okay, first thing he tries to do is he's lying on the ground. He's naked. He got a thing, da, 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 right? And then he gets up and slaps one of the cops. Okay, then he tries to bite somebody. It's amazing. No, it's an epidemic, bath salts. Whether it is or it isn't, let's just go crazy. And come on, look at that. I mean, that dude's got crazy eyes. Okay, and he's got the weird blood in the one of the eyes, and he yeah, he just got pepper sprayed. Like, and what's <laughs> well, amazing <that's> <laughs> is that <laughs> that's a good point. Yeah. After getting tased and pepper sprayed, they still couldn't calm him down, which leads me to believe that he probably was on bath salts because it gives you that superhuman strength, right? Yeah. Where you can get tased like dude, a billion times and it doesn't even affect you. Dude, don't do the bath salts. It's you'll stick a mouse up your ass. <laughs> it's a terrible idea. Okay, and what is it about guys that when all the inhibitions are gone? Immediately, they're like, what do I stick up my ass? Right? Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Well, we actually have a second story of the day that has to do with rectal uh, penetration. And this has to do with a 23-year-old in New Zealand who thought it would be an excellent idea to put fireworks up his butt just to show his friends that he's a tough guy. Well, uh, he caused severe damage to his butt cheeks. In fact, uh, <laughs> Senior Sergeant Gary Smith told the New Zealand Herald, quote, it appears a party was in full progress when a young male decided to place a firework between the cheeks of his bottom and light it up. What must have seemed to be a great idea at the time has backfired, resulting in the, <laughs> in the male Literally. receiving quite severe and very painful burns to his cheeks, back, and private bits. <laughs> this story just got made by the words private bits. I know. <laughs> I like the idea that it backfired. Okay. Disaster. All right. What, how, why are guys so stupid? Like, you, you, we did the story last week of the guy who set his head on fire, right? Women don't set their head on fire. They don't stick firecrackers up their ass, right? Uh, even when it comes to like hazing, why are guys so fascinated with putting things up one another's butts, up their own butts? Like there's like this fascination with it. It's really interesting. Yeah, there's some chance that there's something to it. Yeah. <laughs> like that, uh, that, you know, perhaps they were, I love the idea too. Watch, I'm gonna show you how tough I am. Go ahead, put something in my ass. <laughs> How does that prove how tough you are? Okay, although I gotta give him credit, man. It's pretty tough to take a firecracker in the ass. <laughs>